So yesterday, Miss Vanessa rolled up to Huntsville to come and check on her daughter and her grandkids. Mel says, oh shoot, mama has pulled up. Now today on Melody's Live, Miss Vanessa was her special guest and she gave a little bit of her feedback on Melody's products. So let's take a listen to what she had to say. beautiful as usual all right they said okay they said the queen is in the palace somebody said we somebody said we don't do the ghetto <laughs> somebody said we don't do the ghetto so sis you must be done bought one of her i don't do a ghetto shirts mm -hmm. yes 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 so i'm so excited first of all i'm so happy that she's a part today yes, y'all know she doesn't live here in huntsville with me so you know i get to see her when i get to see her so i'm glad she's here i've done so many tiktok lives but this is your first one that you're a part of yes yay so first seventh <laughs> avenue thank you seventh <laughs> avenue seventh avenue yes Tell them a little bit about how 7th Avenue was, what it meant to us. Okay. Well, 7th Avenue mm -hmm. is a street that Melody grew up on. Mm -hmm. uh, very family oriented, uh, with her being the only baby at that time or toddler at that time, she spent a lot of time with us, the older crowd. Uh, so she became yeah. very knowledgeable, very articulate. Y'all made me sit down and read and learn how to write my name in cursive and stuff. Y'all yeah. was, was teaching me. Yeah, yeah. But she was also very respectful because even though she hung out with us a lot, she knew that everybody was like, mama, mama, mama. So she mm -hmm. knew what her limits were and the things that she could and couldn't do. But it was very important, it was very important to me to make sure that she knew how to be, that she knew how to articulate. You know, tell me how she feel, how she doesn't feel, why this made her sad, why this made her happy. So we really instilled a lot of that stuff into her. Mm -hmm. As far as the brand 7th Avenue, whenever Melody told me that she was going to work on a skincare product based off of the things that my grandmother, which was her great grandmother, mm -hmm. had taught us about caring for her skin when she was growing up, when she would have a breakout like at the beginning of fall over into winter she mm -hmm. would get these breakouts and i didn't know what to do about them 
Yeah, so my grandma came up with something and uh, told me to start using it on her, taught her how to use it, mm -hmm. and we noticed that it quickly helped her through those breakout periods. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be so, so awesome. And I just hate that my grandma, her great grandma, mm -hmm. was not around to see it uh, come into manifestation, this wonderful product that she uses. Mm -hmm. But I wanted to talk about some of the products that I use and share those with you because, yeah, I am a Seventh Avenue mom. <laughs> <laughs> and you yeah, are. I have to buy my products. You don't have to. That's let y'all. She don't have, but she does. <laughs> Cause yeah. she likes to support, but Mama knows little when she yeah. does not have to buy no products. All everybody comes in here and got their products, but she buys them. She does. She will go when I drop something new. She goes online. She makes her purchase, you know, and all that good stuff. Yeah. So I always see that and appreciate it. Before she gets into talking about her Seventh Avenue stuff, let me tell y'all, we also used to have fun on Seventh Avenue. Yeah. Okay. Skating, dancing. Oh my gosh! When I tell y'all, I used to be right out there with the cousins and aunties and the neighbors. Like Outside, yeah, stood up to sun, sundown, mm -hmm. and even with us, even though uh, we were like in our early 20s, yeah, in our yep. teens, being outside on the front porch that was a big thing for us. Yep. We loved hanging outside and uh, just hanging out with the neighbors and stuff, the people in the neighborhood. That's what we did. I remember so, I remember people, it's so crazy. You know how you get older and you remember stuff. I literally re remember people from streets over coming over to Seventh Avenue, Avenue on the weekends. Everybody wanted to have Seventh Avenue. Everybody wanted to be on Seventh Avenue. Everybody wanted to be on Seventh Avenue. <laughs> and took that right out. Everybody wants to be on this Seventh Avenue. Yeah. So let's get into it. <laughs> so I just wanted to talk about some of the products that I use. Mm -hmm. The first thing I, pur I purchased was the Hydrating Duo. Uh -huh. So I had the facial cleanser. I had the uh, hydration oil, the hy hydration uh, toner. Mm -hmm. And then I also had the uh, cleanser. The moisturizer. The moisturizer mm -hmm. there. Yeah, that you have. And I fell in love with the facial cleanser. It's just so silky smooth. Mm -hmm. To me, it almost felt like Cool Whip or something. It does feel cooling. And yeah. whenever you put it on your face, it's just so smooth and it cleans your face without you being abrasive with your face. Mm -hmm. You know, you just put it on, you rub it in, you get a soft cloth and you just clean it off. And I love that. Um, I also like um, the facial cream. I loved it. It was. My face is sort of like a combination, meaning around my nose, I get very oily. <laughs> but on my forehead, I get dry patches. I'm just very dry, and I have a tendency to burn on my forehead a lot. So what I had noticed was after I reached that age of 50, <laughs> products that I had been using on my face wasn't working anymore. There was, some of them was actually causing my face to irritate. Meaning it took care of the oiliness around my nose, but then it dried out my forehead even more. So when I started using the 7th Avenue products, what I noticed was I could use it all over my face and it didn't irritate one area and help the other. Um, and also as I got older, <laughs> I noticed I started getting pores on my nose. Mm. And I hated oh. that. And I'm like, oh no. What age did you realize? that you started getting them like you really paid it because you know like, like 53 I really started noticing mm. like at the age of 53 I really started noticing so when I started using that I started noticing that my pores started not being so noticeable like they were getting better and I really like that because I hated the pores on my nose mm -hmm. but that was the very first product that I used was a hydration set mm -hmm. the hydrating duo yeah and the lip primer I use this. Mm -hmm. This is very, very good because my lips had a tendency to get dry in the corners. The rest of my lips were fine, but in the corners of my lip, it would get very dry. And I would have to use chapstick over and over and over again throughout mm -hmm. the day. But with the primer, I usually put it on in the morning. And then I may put it on again at night after I take my shower and stuff right before I get ready to go to bed. But I'm not applying it over and over and over again throughout the day. Mm -hmm. And I noticed a very big difference in my lips. They're much smoother. They don't chap so 
that don't chop as bad as they were doing like in the corners. Yeah. So yeah. And doesn't the lip primer smell good too? It does. The lip oh, primer, y'all. The lip primer, baby. Listen. Well, the facial cleanser. I yeah. love the smell of all of the products. Mm -hmm. I love the smell of all of the products. You know what, Mama? One thing about it was I wanted because when you think about your face, right, and you're you think about being around people, talking to people, and they may get close to your face. I didn't want it to be to have things that were super strong. Right. I wanted the facial products to still smell very, um, very, um, is she related to the lamp, please? Hey, yes, we are. Um, I wanted it to stay super just soft and just like a clean smell. Right. You know what I mean? Just clean. Um, and so, yeah, that's, the, I, I'm glad to hear you say that you felt like that when you, you know. Right. So this is definitely the high the Hydro Duo, this is definitely my first go-to. Mm -hmm. Now I started using some of the other things that she's had added into it. I love the body oil. Mm -hmm. I really love the body oil. It's a big seller too. When I tell you that you buy this body oil, I can't keep body oil up in here. And I love the body oil because when you apply it, it's very light. You can't tell that you've actually put something on your skin, but it gives you like a natural glow. Mm -hmm. And with me, it was important for me to have something that if I decided to wear a silk blouse or something like that, I didn't want to see residue on my clothing for what I have applied to my skin. Mm -hmm. And with the body oil, I haven't noticed that in any of my clothing. Or, you know, you get in your, you, you lotion yourself down, you get in your car if you got leather seats, and you lay your arm up there and you take mm -hmm. it up and that's the good. Whole spot on that's the leather good. seat where you were sitting at. Yeah. I hated that. But with the body oil, I don't have that issue and it makes my skin feel very soft very mm -hmm. smooth and it gives me like I said like a natural glow mm -hmm. so that's what I love about the body oil Ooh, yes yes the body oil I promise you guys it is amazing um you know it just really gives you like you said it gives you a nice little glow um and again not transferring and i've seen that right. before too where you can put something on you get in your vehicle and then it's all over your seat you know what i'm saying it's all over your seat so they're saying miss van is beautiful thank you <laughs> that body oil is the truth i love the body oil um Miss Van is an excellent speaker. I see this where Melody gets it from. Thank you. Mel is so beautiful. My favorite thing about the body oil is the natural glow. It doesn't look or feel oily. Right. 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 So, so go ahead. Oh, were you about to say something else? I was gonna talk about the other products. Oh, okay. Did you use that? Okay. So the other pro the next product that I tried was when she dropped the lemon lime. Lemonade, lemonade. Yeah, the lemonade. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, okay, go ahead. I love the body scrub. Mm -hmm. I love the facial scrub. I love the lip scrub. Mm -hmm. I love all of them. The body scrub, I also use that on my on the heel of my feet. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. I also notice as I get older, my uh, soles was feel a little rough. And I, I was always one of those people who I was like, I do not want rough looking elbows. I want my elbows to still look girly like. So I pay extra attention to my elbows with the lemon body scrub. And it works good for that as well. Mm. And it's and I love the smell. <laughs> I love the smell. You know? So it was nice to see Miss Vanessa's perspective on Melody's products and her feedback. Uh, but let me know your thoughts about all of this. And also, it was just good to know that she was there with Melody and the kids. Well, all right, you guys, I thank you all for watching and listening. And I will talk to you in the next video.